Afiwe Global Health Emerging Leaders Program. Yeah, of course, so no. I just want to make sure you have no more. You are not medicine, pharmacy, herbal medicine, nursing. You can't hold on to do more. You are not going to be able to do more. You are not going to be able to do more. You are not going to be able to do more. You are not going to be able to do more. You are not going to be able to do more. You are not going to be able to do more. You are not going to be able to do more. You are not going to be able to do more. You are not going to be able to do more. You are not going to be able to do more. You are not going to be able to do more. Akoso ewa maya hudwa kumu etu mpomu Se bani se mwenye yushimu afa Nye gruba health o hao ahudwe mwono Amaya afina wamu e yufri siyano Ya na mwamu adeno ewa fom Nini nazi zika sam Ya bebo mwamu jumedi yesi ako Akoso no ibini ho E na afi so facilities Ya ye biya ya te se E bebo mwamu yushimu apaswa akoso yinano Wamu e nibi Pengini ba akon ya o kampe nifuwa Omba jumedi na CBO ye senior lecturer Ewa Harvard University Ne London School of Hygiene Ne ba ye Tropical medicine. Ning the four done. Please know. Or by the shion for no abaso. Your name GCT because you didn't come on. If I made the answer. What we want with them is to become very good critical thinkers and leaders in global health so that they will know how to negotiate with other countries. They would know how, for example, we had a calculation for the cost effectiveness of programs. They know the values of what a leader should have and they know who are the players in global health, how the funding flows, and they know the situation of other countries and how other countries can help their own country. Coordinator, you're gonna have Emma African Youth Global Leadership Program, a Dr. Kwesi Yalaj, but also at Nsembi at Uja. We are hoping that by the end of the session, people would develop good research skills, they would develop good um, leadership skills, that when we go out there, we know what we are about. We believe that the next WHO officials, the next UN officials, ministers of health, district directors of health, all of these people would have been people who have passed through the Global Health Emerging Leaders Program. And we are hoping that the next time we organize such an event, more people would come on board, be trained, and then benefit from this. Additional form with the acquittal which made in Musuni GCT because the airborne come My experience in this very program um, are numerous and I must say how Prof handles the topic is very good. For example, how he handles leadership, practically using the, 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 the face mask um, workshop and that of the, the back bag um, workshop, they are all good, it becomes practical and it does not only apply in the health setting, it applies generally when it comes to leadership and I believe that some people too never knew how to um, keep on, uh, how to move on with their health career but with our experience over here we've known that from this level I can move to this academia, I can move to this very field, I can go to that field. Joining this program has been a very great experience, I've learned a lot of things about global health, leadership and how to maneuver my way through research. I would advise it to everyone and encourage people to register during the next one. Additional form the opportunity to make the money, it be a bomb basso. Yeah, we must also certificate and be the one who is human.